Hey everyone, I'm JP and welcome to Good Talk HQ. Thanks for checking out today's video. We appreciate you being here and hopefully we help you save a few dollars while finding an amazing new game to play. To the extended family, welcome back my friends. Thanks as always. In today's episode, we're going to cover some of the best deals that you can find for under $10 right now on the Switch eShop and we'll discuss a few of those amazing Digirati bundles that are back on sale once again. We even have a game or two that'll qualify you for the OLED giveaway that we discussed in the last video, so if you missed it, be sure to check it out as it's a fantastic giveaway and worth at least looking into. And if this is your first time here, welcome to the channel. We're Nintendo Switch fans for sure, and we love sharing the deals with our awesome community. If you have a good time today, consider subscribing down below to become part of our wonderful group. We love welcoming new members, and we also do eShop gift card giveaways at the end of each month as a way of saying thank you. All you have to do to enter is be subbed to the channel, hit that like button down below, and leave us a comment so we can find your name and put you on the current list. Either way though, as always my friends, stay safe out there and please enjoy the video. Alright, let's go ahead and start off the list with the Digirati Indie Darling Bundle Volume 3. This is an absolutely awesome deal from Digirati and comes with four great games. You get 1979 Revolution Black Friday which is a deeply narrative experience and award winning drama, Shikondo the Bullet Hell Storm featured in a couple of the bundles, Nefarious which is a 2D platformer where you play as the villain which is also found in the anti-hero bundle and then of course you also get Omega Strike which is an awesome 2D platformer and worth the price alone. Now this bundle is normally $50 and right now it's marked down to just $7.57 which is 85% off and matching an all time low. If you were thinking of picking up any of these games individually, make sure to consider this instead. Before the sale ends on December 16th, it's marked down 85% once again matching an all time low of just $7.57. Shakedown Hawaii is a unique pixel art single player adventure from publisher V Blank Entertainment and offers roughly 10 to 15 hours of main story gameplay and a download size of about 172 megabytes. The story follows three protagonists through a 16 bit open world that feels alive and supplanted from the 80s. The music, the themes, the colors all feel retro and reminiscent of the decade. It plays a lot like an old school GTA from a top down view, and your goal is to become the biggest tycoon on the island. Now once you finish the main story which was outstanding, there really isn't a whole lot of replayability but for that first playthrough alone it's worth the price and right now it's on sale until December 7th, marked down 50% to just $9.99. The Digirati Couch Co-op Bundle Volume 2 is another bundle with 4 great games. This time you'll get Black Paradox which is a fast paced shoot 'em up with a vibrant pixel art aesthetic and an awesome soundtrack. Shikondo, which is an absolutely gorgeous bullet hell style game steeped in Asian mythology. Vertical Drop Heroes, which is an RPG with procedurally generated worlds, and of course, Bleed. The bundle is normally $46 and right now it's marked down to just $6.89, which again is 85% off and matching an all-time low. Once again, if you're thinking of getting any of the games individually, make sure that you consider this before the sale ends on December 16th. It's marked down 85%, again matching an all-time low, $6.89. Willie Jetman Astro Monkey's Revenge is a single player 2D arcade style platform shooter from BLG Publishing with a download size just over 1.1 gigs and a main story that will last roughly 9 to 10 hours to wrap up. Now this is a game that was developed by a team that has a passion for console classics from the 90s and this game feels like it was ripped right from that era and then given some modern gameplay mechanics to add that extra level of depth to the overall experience. You'll get to explore, fight, earn XP, and upgrade your weapons as we try to save our friends and become a galactic hero. If you're looking for a hidden gem on the eShop, I know the name is a bit silly but the gameplay is solid and right now it's on sale until December 17th. Mark down 66% to a new all time low of just $5.09. Xeno Crisis is an arcade style arena shooter for 1 to 2 players with a download size of just 220 megabytes and a main story that will last roughly 3 to 4 hours but there's a ton of replayability here so you'll likely stretch it a lot further than that for sure. Now this is a true port of the original 16 bit game with some extras added in for modern gamers. The incredible pixel art makes its return and of course that awesome chiptune soundtrack is back as well. There are multiple difficulty levels, multiple weapons to master and hordes of enemies to take out. Once again, the addition of local co-op is always a great touch, and if you're interested in Xeno Crisis, be sure to check it out before the sale ends on December 7th. It's marked down 50% to a new all-time low of just $9.99. The Anti-Hero Bundle is another bundle of three games from publisher Digirati and includes Nefarious, a 2D platformer once again where you get to play the villain and wreak havoc across five different stages. 
Reverse Crawl, a fast-paced strategy RPG which has you controlling armies of the undead against elite heroes, and of course, Underhero, another 2D platformer, this time with a bit more story and RPG added in. Now this bundle normally goes for $41, and right now it's marked down to just $614, which again is 85% off and matching an all-time low. Again, if you're thinking of getting any of the games individually, make sure to consider this one first. Once again, it's at an all-time low of just $614 until December 16th. Tanuki Justice is an action platformer from No Gravity Games and is available for one to two players in local co-op with the main story that will last roughly two or three hours to wrap up, but it's a great time and has plenty of replayability. We set out on a mission to take out the evil overlord and that's really the only story to speak of at the beginning of the game. This is a great platformer set in Japan with absolutely amazing pixel art graphics and the boss battles are a highlight for us once again. Now this is another one of those pick up and go for like 15 or 30 minutes and then put it back down for pure fun. Each level is varied both in detail, scenery, and enemy type and while there are some rehashed elements, every level introduces something new. The controls are great as well and it offers a lock on feature which I always love in these type of games. If you're interested in Tanuki Justice, make sure to check it out while on sale before December 23rd. It's currently marked down 53% to a new all time low of just $6.99. Stitchy and Tuki Trouble is a single player platform adventure game from Forever Entertainment with a 2.2 GB download size and a main story that will last roughly 3 or 4 hours to wrap up. In this one players get to run, jump, slide, and more through a variety of stages with unique environments and amazing visuals. There are 9 different levels, each with an epic boss battle at the end and for those willing to explore a little bit there's even a secret level that you can unlock as well. The story is very reminiscent of an old fairy tale and the game is a true joy to play here on the Switch. If you're interested in Stitchy and Tukey Trouble, be sure to grab it up before the sale ends on December 9th. It's marked down 50% to a new all-time low of just $6.49. Paradise Lost is a single-player 3D adventure game from All In Games with a download size just under 6 gigs and a main story that will last roughly 14 hours to wrap up. In Paradise Lost, we play as a young boy trying to find a mysterious person that our mother knew before she passed. We'll descend into a futuristic bunker and explore a large underground city while piecing together the story and we even get some help from an unexpected ally along the way. Now this is also part of the OLED giveaway from Cubic and Friends that we discussed in the last video so be sure to enter the contest if you end up picking this one up. If you're interested it's on sale until December 17th mark down 40% to a new all time low of just $8.99. Demon's Crystals is an arcade style shooter from Badland Games with a download size of just 1.1 gigs and unlimited hours of multiplayer action for 2 to 4 players. Of course the game can be played solo but it really was designed to be played by a group of people with the goal of blasting through the 3 worlds and then facing off against the boss at the end. There's also a leveling system for your characters which gives a little more incentive to keep coming back. The game actually has multiple game modes including the survival mode which was probably my favorite and just has you go until you die. If you're interested in Demon's Crystals, be sure to grab it up before the sale ends on December 17th. It's marked down 66% to just $509. In My Shadow is a single player puzzle platformer from Over Games with a download size of just 1.5GB and a main story that will last roughly 4 hours to wrap up. The game has a cool mechanic where you have to manipulate your shadow in order to solve the current puzzle and progress through to the next. There are more than 50 different puzzles to solve across 4 different rooms and as you solve the puzzles you'll start to uncover the young girl's memories as well which was a nice touch. This game is one of the more unique games that I've played in a while and if you're interested it's currently on sale until December 16th marked down 20% to a new all time low of just $9.60. Be sure to check it out. Depth of Extinction is a single player tactical turn based RPG similar to XCOM and Mario plus Rabbids but in this title players will explore a world that is almost entirely underwater and overrun by machines. The graphics and sound are great in this title and while it may not have the budget of something like Mario plus Rabbids it's a great indie title and the game is truly fun to play. This mainly comes down to the combat in the game which was a highlight for me personally. There are upgrade mechanics and over a hundred different weapons to be found throughout the campaign. If you like strategy based RPGs make sure to grab this one up before December 20th it's marked down 65% to just 524 a new all time low. Romancing Saga 3 is a single player 2D RPG with a download size of 1.8 gigs and more than 40 hours of main story gameplay making it one of the bigger games on the list and a great value. 
This is a remastered version that was released here for the first time in the West with enhanced graphics, new explorable dungeons, new story scenarios, and even the coveted New Game Plus. There are 8 playable characters, all very unique from one another, the graphics and sound are top notch, and again more than 40 hours of gameplay on offer. If you're interested in Romancing Saga 3, it's currently on sale until December 18th, marked down 70% to a new lowest price of just $8.69, and while there, be sure to check out Part 2 as well as it's also on sale. Lost Words Beyond the Page is a single player 2D adventure platformer from Modus Games with a download size of 6GB and roughly 5 hours of main story gameplay. Now the game is all about atmosphere and heavily driven by the story. The entire thing takes place within the pages of a young girl's diary, and the worlds are beautiful, I love the watercolor aesthetic that they went with, plus the way they incorporated the use of words as power tools to complete the stages was really awesome as well. You have to harness the power of words in order to alter the environment or create a pathway that's safe to progress. It's a really cool idea and a really cool game, make sure to check it out before the sale ends on December 7th, it's marked down 50% to an all time low of just $7.49. The Trine Ultimate Collection is one of the best values on the list as you get 4 complete games and each of them is worth a playthrough at least once. Now these are adventure style platformers available for up to 4 players and each has a substantial story that will last at least 5 hours or so. In the first 3 games players will discover, learn to understand, and seek to control the powers bestowed upon them by Trine. And in the newest entry players will face their toughest challenge yet as you set out to confront a troubled young wizard, Prince Celius. Trine 4 is probably the standout in the collection, but as I said, all the games are good enough for at least one playthrough. And if you're interested in the Trine Ultimate Collection, make sure to grab it up before the sale ends on December 7th. It's marked down 80% to just $9.99, matching an all-time low. In Rays of the Light is a single-player 3D adventure game with an eerie setting and an immersive soundtrack. The game has a download size of just 1.5 gigs and a main story that will last maybe 2 or 3 hours to wrap up. Now this is basically a walking sim with some puzzle solving thrown in to progress the story, which centers around a sole survivor in an abandoned building that is overgrown and in ruins. Now you get to uncover parts of the story through notes or letters that you find, and there were a few tense moments where you get a really uneasy feeling, but for the most part it's a peaceful meditative game that allows you to fully enjoy that story. The game looks and runs great here on the Switch, and if you're interested make sure to pick it up before December 18th, it's marked down 30% to just $5.59 matching an all time low. Alright folks, and as always, here are some other games to check out while on the eShop. Alright folks, that's going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode. Thank you everyone for rocking with us again today and making it through another video. If you're still here, you know you're legendary and we truly appreciate you giving us a few minutes today. I hope we helped you save a few dollars and maybe found a game or two that you had never heard of before. We love sharing the deals and we love welcoming new members to our group here at the channel, so if this was your first time here and you had a good time, please hit that red button before you head out. We'd love to welcome you and again it'll enter you into the giveaway for this month as well. Alright folks, happy hunting, happy gaming, and we'll let Little Man take us home as always. Stay safe out there. Bye everyone. That's all for today's list. We hope you liked the video. If you did, consider subscribing and liking down below. Okay, bye!